To judge this challenge, I have brought in one of the most respected food writers across America. She's currently the executive editor of one of the most popular magazines anywhere in the world, Every Day with Rachel Ray. Wow. Please say hello to my friend, Dana Bowen. <laughs> hello, my darling. Hey. This woman knows her food inside and out and around the world. It was a little intimidating. Thank you for having me. Um, I'm excited about this challenge. Brilliant. Um, let's start off with Indian cuisine, shall we? Indian, great. Mary and John, please. Mary. Today I did a pan seared lamb loin. It's crusted with garam masala. Underneath it's grilled eggplant puree. I'm looking at my plate and I'm wishing that I had my basmati rice. For me, it's just missing that right now. I'm really nervous. It's, it's, it's beautifully done. The spices are not overwhelming. Lamb's delicious. It really is so tender. Mm -hmm. It's great. Oh my gosh, they love it. Maybe rice is overrated. John, please. So here I kind of did a take on a tandoor chicken. You got a honey riata with some pistachios in it. Made the chicken a little spicier and then I glazed it with some honey at the end. Mm. Very um, tender. That's very nice. Yeah, um, it's delicious. What I love about this dish, it instantly says Indian cuisine. Um, it could go red team, blue team. I have to say, I think they both have um, strong points to them. Um, but I'm going to have to go with the tandoori chicken. Blue team, well done. Good, Good, job. Job. Good start. Good job. Uh, we couldn't at least get a tie. Uh, one point for blue. Next, Thai cuisine. With the victory deprived blue team taking an early lead, it's now time for Nedra to face her old teammate and nemesis, Janelle. Nedra, please. I have here um, a nice curry broth and some deep fried calamari. Fried calamari, don't see a lot of in Thailand. I wanted to do just something out of the box. The calamari is nicely cooked, but uh, I'm not getting a lot of herbs or other flavors. This is very highly seasoned. Flavors haven't been cooked out. Never cooked Thai before, so. Okay. Uh, Janelle, please. I wanted to do just a nice steamed halibut. I made a lemongrass coconut broth. Well, that's just gorgeous. This is a, a smart reinterpretation of a Thai classic dish. Really? Oh, that's fantastic. Really? Like, really? It's got that vibrance to it. What? And, and what's, let me just. Mm, that's delicious. Come on. The fish is soaking up the flavors of the coconut milk. I just think this is remarkable. Like, seriously? Red team or blue team? I have to say red team. What the fuck, really? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Good job, Nedra. Uh, Janelle, great job. And what I also appreciated about that dish is, is you knew when to stop, yes. when not to add more to it. I think you did a beautiful job. OK, whatever. Thank you. Next up. With Janelle outclassing Nedra, the score is all tied up. Now it's time to see who will win. The Battle of Greece, let's go. Anthony or Cindy? Cindy, please present your dish. Uh, today I prepared a stuffed chicken roulade and uh, an orzo salad with mint. Mm. Wow. This is delicious. The chicken is very well done. It's seasoned beautifully. Thank you. Anthony, please. I have a seared lamb. The sauce underneath is uh, plain Greek yogurt with plum and mint. Nicely cooked. Yeah, that uh, lamb. It's like butter. The plum is, is is sort of muddying the flavors a little bit. The red team or the blue team? Just say red team. Thank red you. Red team. Uh, Cindy, good job. Thanks, Pretty chef. good job. Yes! Two to one. We've got this in the bag. 